What's going on, YT? It's Platinum. Coming to share with you a collective haul. Thank you for tuning in. I so appreciate you for that. Please know that whether you're viewing, leaving a comment, you're just browsing by, whatever. And if you're not subscribing, if you see something in this video that you think you'll like to see in future, go ahead and push that subscribe button. Okay, um, today is July 27, 2016. I went to a couple of stores and let's get started. Um, please forgive the shakiness of this video. I got some bootleg contraption shirt um, set up here. I got this shirt. The shirt was from Ross and I thought it was so cute. And it has butterflies and elephants on it. And it reminds me of the Shiki shirt. And it has a um, drawstring waistline, which the waistline is very, very small. So I'm going to have to extend this right here to make it work for my thickum's stomach. Yeah, I love the colors on here. A host of purples, turquoise, white, and so forth. I'm just going to pull it how I see it. I'm all over the place, so bear with me. I got these from Maxwell. And this is Clear Basic Cosmetic Applicators, 100% cotton tips. And it's a vanity pack. And there's 285 applicators in here. And I thought this would be a great addition to add to my beauty um, collection and my um, vanity you know, touch up on the makeups and so forth. And I love the fact that it has a pointed tip. And then the other is a basic Q-tip style. And these was the only, they, they had a dollar on it, but it rung up two for a dollar, which I didn't see until I got to the register. So I got that one. And then I got this one. Same thing. I'll probably give the brown one to my daughter and keep the green one for myself. Also got some Purell hand sanitizer. And what else is in here? Let's go to Ross. I went to Ross in Virginia. And I haven't been to Ross. I haven't been to Ross since I lived in Georgia, Columbus, Georgia, and I think Atlanta. And it's been some few years now. And I really couldn't take my time and look how I wanted to, you know, look throughout the store because I had my peoples outside waiting for me. But anywho, this is the first thing I'm going to show you. And I love the fact that it's pink inside. And let's see. There we go. Love the lips. I love anything with lips on it. And this is what the outer part of the box looks like. And this was only... Let's say yeah four ninety nine that part undecided what I'm gonna put in here. I don't know what's going on with me. I'm like on a box thing just to me it's like when I got a bunch of stuff, even if it's um the presentation is so much more sexy when it's presented in a box versus having a bunch of stuff piled in one area but when you put it in a box it's more appealing to the eye that's just my take that's just my opinion um the next box i'm going to show you it says we are all stars you better believe it baby and then again the pink inside and on the outside this one has black spots polka dots whatever you want to call it and I thought this one was super sexy, so I went ahead and purchased it. And this one was 
$3.99. I hope you guys ain't dizzy yet. Okay. Is that it for Ross? Um, yeah. I believe that's it for Ross. Okay. Um, I went to Forever 21. And, no, these was from Maxwell. I'm about to tell a lie. And they were $1.99. I did go to Forever 21. And I don't have what I purchased from there. They're in the other room. And I'm not about to get up and go get it. So they'll be featured in another video. And I thought these earrings were so pretty. Can you see the detail on them? And then a little rose. Red rose. And being that I have five holes in my ears, I thought that this would be a great addition to add to my jewelry collection. And I love the fact that it comes in three array of sizes on the earrings. And the other one's probably in the bag, hopefully. Because they all were there when I purchased them. Nope, I don't see it. Oh, here it is. I got it. Okay. There we go. Okay. Um, I got these shoes from... Lane Bryant and I originally purchased them for my grandmother's funeral um I was wearing all white and all silver I had on a silver and white statement piece necklace silver earrings silver bracelets and I wanted to wear some silver shoes but when I got there I changed my mind because I'm like, wait a minute, I went and got a pedicure, got my feet looking all cute. So I switched the game up and ended up wearing some um, different shoes. Where am I going with this? Oh, Bath and Body Works. I got this Boy Walk Vanilla Cone Gentle Foaming. And it smells, it smells like like a cupcake or some type of bakery. It smells good. It's marshmallow fluff, vanilla bean, and cream caramel. Boardwalk vanilla cone. I also went to TJ Maxx and picked up a couple of pieces there. I saw the shirt and it reminded me of a cowboy theme or rug ruggedness theme. And I don't know, when I saw it, I just seen myself pairing it up with a pair of jeans and some Uggs. So I went ahead and purchased it. And being that it was in my size, long sleeve, comfy, you can wear it with a jean jacket. And like I said, some jeans. But what got me was the price. It was only $8. Let me see if I can show y'all. And I just thought it was cute. It caught my eye. And again, it was long sleeve. And it does give off that rugged, distressed look, as you can see. And two more pieces from TJ Maxx. I purchased this Ralph Lauren shirt. Um, it's so soft and has a great amount of stretch to it. And it's pink and white v-neck theme. And it's a size 2X. I like it for one, 
being it's a sweater, you can walk, rock it in the fall. If you go on an airplane or something and you're cold, this will give you, you know, that extra warmth. But yet and still, you go back outside, you won't be, you know, too, too hot. And it's short sleeve, if I didn't say so or show so. And... $89 had you purchased this, you know, from Macy's or Nordstrom or something like that. Excuse me, guys. And I got it for $22. I have yet to try it on, so I got to see how it looks on me. But, yeah, I thought that was really cute. And I could see myself rocking that in the month of October. Also, last but not least, from TJ Maxx, I purchased these sheets. I fell in love with the color. Um, dorm bedroom, dorm bedroom, microfiber set. I don't know how it's coming off on camera, but it's a coral peachy color. I love vibrant, bright colors, so when I saw this, I was like, yes. Mm, one flat, one fitted, one pillowcase. No, this one has two pillowcases. That's it from TJ Maxx. I did um, purchase some other stuff, but I gave it to... Let me try to clear some of this stuff out the way. So I can show you what I got from Home Goods. Forgive me, y'all. I didn't feel like getting on camera today, so we rock on this type of video. I purchased these pillows from Home Goods. And they have the honeycomb cover on them. Let's see. And they are by Calvin Klein. And these were 20 bucks. Let's see the detailing of the pillows. Honeycomb pillow, like I said. Resilient, lofty down, alternative fill for lasting comfort. 230 thread count, 100% pure cotton cover with delicate honeycomb pattern. Signature linen label, hypoallergenic. That's what got me. Two standard queen size. Two pack pillows. And that's it. That's the only thing I purchased from Home Goods. Um, and I went to, what is it, Office Max. And I've been trying to purchase these forever, but they're pricey. So it took me a minute to get them. What this is, is you see this right here. This is Avery True Block Shipping Labels. Jam and smudge free laser and templates, and there's two labels per sheet. And this is 500 labels. And this was $60, you guys. So hopefully, this lasts me a while. Um, yeah, and then it gives you, you know, the little thing on the back. Design and print, quick and easy print works with PC, Mac, and tablet. Choose from thousands of blank and pre-designed templates. So you can use this besides printing labels, but I, I'm using it for shipping labels. So, yeah, that completes my haul. Y'all forgive me. I know this was a hot mess all over the place video. Um, yeah, I'm going to get out y'all ear. Y'all enjoy the rest of your day. As always, keep it sexy, y'all. Toodles, y'all.